Hi everyone, in these short videos I would like to show you how you can draw the main textures which are commonly used in interior sketching. So I'm going to show you how we can draw the texture of wood, concrete, metal, glass and marble, black and white. Of course you can always find a ready texture in the internet and use it in your interior sketching but I think that you still need to know how you can draw them by your own. In case you don't find necessary texture you will always be able to draw it by yourself. So let's open our Procreate up and create new canvas. We choose centimeters 29 by 21. 300 dpi which is more than enough and we tap create let's also rotate our canvas to have it vertically and also let's open a reference with the image of all textures that we will be drawing this is our textures and let me show you how you can draw them very quickly by using standard procreate brushes in order for us to draw straight lines, we need to switch on Drawing Assist. We go to the Actions tool, Drawing Guide, Edit Drawing Guide, and we select 2D Grid. Not necessary to specify the grid size, we press Done. And now we can switch off Drawing Guide. Ok, let's start with the first texture, which will be Stone. Let's go to the Selection tool, choose Rectangle, so we can draw straight away rectangle like this let's fill it up with color we can either select the color we need from the palette something like that or we can select it from the image so let's choose this color and we simply drop it to our selected rectangle okay in order for us to draw a texture within borders of this rectangle we need to switch on the alpha lock feature go to the layers alpha lock and we switch it on so it means now whatever we'll be drawing will be within the area of our rectangle without alpha lock on feature you see we can uh, go outside of our rectangle so to undo i press this arrow Mm -hmm. Okay, let's switch on back our alpha lock feature. There are several brushes in Procreate library that you can use to create a texture of stone or concrete. I will show you which brushes I use. So most of the times mm, I use brush called heavy metal or rusted decay. Um, you can find them in the industrial folder. I will use heavy metal brush. So from the main color, we select a darker shade and we simply cover the whole area of our rectangle, something like that. Now we can select lighter shade. We can reduce size of our brush and opacity. And we do the same, not everywhere, but just, you know, in some parts. So this is texture we got. Actually, our texture of stone or concrete looks very nice already and you can leave it as it is, but I think I will add some more details. I want to find the brush called uh, Pencil Narinder. Uh, if I'm not mistaken, you can find it in the sketching folder. This is the brush. It's a very thin brush and with a very dark uh, shade, I want to add some lines. I can choose even darker shades and with full opacity just to draw some thin lines somewhere you like that like that you can use as a base the lines from our heavy metal brush we draw previously so these are some lines you can after add some brighter lines somewhere and it's like scratch scratches this is the bright one, yes. Mm -hmm. And our texture is ready. And now to show, to create the realistic look of something, we need to do two things. The first one is texture, which we already did. And the second one is the volume. To create a volume, let's select the brush, copy marker, and we select the main color, we go a bit darker. And with a very low opacity, about 1%, the brush size we can make a bit bigger. So let's make our left side darker. 
I don't press too much on my pencil and I don't hold it vertically. I hold it maybe about 40% degree and I draw with the side of my pencil tip. So I can select after brighter color and other side, the right one, I can add some light to make it lighter, brighter. So this is the texture. Let's go back to our dark color and also make corners a bit darker. That's it. I really like how it looks. And now we can go to the next texture, which is wood.